Right. Well, as we can imagine, in a game, a simple game like this, where you have a rule that you can only shoot if you have not moved, then that can mean that you will see several turns where perhaps very little movement will take place because it is better for the troops to stay where they are and shoot than it is to move. So now we have the French turn, and the French commander has indeed not moved at all, and it's just going to stand pat and shoot. There's an interesting dynamic here over with the uh, situation where we have the uh, French cavalry and French infantry faced off against the British cavalry and British infantry, in the sense that the French commander on his turn could either decide to have the the cavalry charge, and then if they don't destroy the enemy, which they wouldn't because they they haven't taken enough casualties yet, they'll bounce back, so they'll inflict some losses. Um, but they, if they do that, then, of course, they would charge and they would end up there, and they cannot fire at the... Uh, actually, using house rules that I've developed, they cannot, they cannot fire at the enemy if they're in hand-to-hand -hand combat. There are no actual rules... Uh, in these simple rules that say that. So um, that means that it's, it's, it's like either they can shoot at them and attack them that way, or they can charge them and attack them that way, but they can't do both. So um, although we've got cavalry and, and infantry over here, and of course one can imagine situations where that's actually uh, quite realistic. So anyway, um, a realistic simulation of the actual uh, situation. So we've got the French um, uh, now then going on to their uh, shooting phase. And we can have, we know that um, all of the French three units here can fire on this one British, if they choose so they can all fire at this uh, British unit here. So that's what they're going to do. So first we'll have uh, the French infantry um, firing at the British infantry over there. And they've rolled up five hits. And then we've got two artillery batteries. We have to subtract two. Nothing then on that one. And that's a one. So it's a total of six hits that they've caused on that British infantry unit over there. I'll record that now. 